Hi chums, um, we're on the potatoes again. These are Cara and somebody asked me in a comment, what do you do that with your hands for at the start of a video? I'm making sure that my hands are in the screen so that the viewfinder is getting as much of the wheelbarrow as possible. Okay folks, um, these are Cara and well, let's see what happens. I've got all the potatoes inside at the moment because um, it's got very frosty. We're getting frost at night and on Tuesday of this week, this is Sunday, um, on last Tuesday we had snow. Now it wasn't a lot of snow but there was enough that I had to clear the windows in the car before it could actually drive off. So a dusting of snow, a dusting of snow. Right. So I've moved all the potatoes inside the greenhouse now. Okay, and got my wee dish. Right folks, that last video I made about depression and suicide and mental health issues, I was going to answer the people, oh look at that. Isn't that good? There's just let you see it in my hand, the size of it. That's a good size. I was going to answer the comments, the, the many, many comments I got, but I decided not to because I had said what I wanted to say in the video and a lot of you people shared a lot of very, very personal stuff with us or with me on the comments. Now, whenever I view a video, I would tend to read the comments because the comments are sometimes really good. Look at that one. The comments can be quite superb at times. So I would read comments and I enjoy the comments, but in this situation, I decided not to reply to any of the comments because the content was very personal. People bared their souls. A lot of people did bear their souls about their own personal fight with depression and with mental health issues. So I didn't want to go on and start saying thank you very much, yeah, thank you very much and thanks for your comment, like, like I normally do, you know, and start adding bits in. Because I didn't want to disrupt the flow of the comments. I had said my bit in the video and then the comments came in and the comments flowed from the video very nicely. So I just left them as they were and I will leave it like that. Because out of respect to the people who have made those comments, I don't want to mess up the content by interrupting the flow and then someone might not read your comment because they get fed up with me interrupting so that's the way I've left it so instead of answering you all I'll just say thank you very much to you all now because you really did enhance the quality of that video with your own responses and it made it a lot more powerful than it ever might have been so for that I thank you um, I'm not going to dwell on this from now on. I'm, I'm still not in a place where I feel I can do amusing videos and stuff. Um, so it's going to take a wee while for us to come to terms with, with what happened basically. So I'm not going to be doing funny videos and stuff, but I'm still going to continue with videos, just sort of factual videos. I also I don't want to lose touch with you either because it's very easy for people to forget about you if you're not making videos. Now, I'm not making any monies. As you know, I'm not monetized. I do this for fun. I don't want to get involved in the money side of it because then you have to be careful about that. You don't have a product placement issue or a music issue. I don't do use music because I don't edit. But you have all this stuff that ties you down with uh, YouTube, so I prefer not to bother with that. I just stick the videos up as they are and then nobody can start shouting about copyright violations and all the rest of it, you know? So I want to keep going because even though I'm not making money out of it, I, I don't want to lose people either because you're, you're my friends now and I, I, don't, I don't want to lose you. So uh, I'm going to keep doing just, just a, few, a few videos like this and just keep my hand in until such times as sort of we get our heads back together again, you know. Um, comments. Yeah, that brings me nicely on to Google+. Plus. I'm not going to do a Google Plus rant here because about 87,000 billion people have already done that and I agree with every one of them. The bottom line is 
we don't like change. <laughs> I really don't like change. I, I, don't, I don't like it at all. I find change hard to cope with. Um, so from that point of view, I don't like it. But what I also don't like is I can't manage my way around it and it makes me feel st sort of stupid, you know? And I'm, I'm finding it very hard to work the Google, the whole new Google thing. I don't have one of those fancy phones with the apps on it where you, you kind of, that's your phone face and you kind of do this business where you slide windows across and stuff. I, I don't have that, so I'm finding it very hard to get used to. I'm even getting hard, hard to get used to Google Windows 8. And it seems as if Google Plus is kind of based on those app operation type things. So the young people, who are their future market, you have to remember, oldies like me, will maybe have another 10 or 20 or 30 years in this, but they want the young ones who are going to have another 50 or 60 years in them. So it's all designed to keep those people entertained because we're of no use, basically. Um, us oldies are of no use. So we just have to try and keep up as best we can. So uh, my big issue is I don't really understand what's happening. And I'm getting my inbox. I like to keep my inbox pretty clean, you know. It's a complete mess at the moment because I'm getting invitations to join circles. Um, I'm getting invitations to join different sort of oh, interest-based clubs, if you like. And I would go, I've actually clicked on most of those because I'm getting some good information. Um, Dale, Dale Calder um, has sent me a lot of different clubs that I, he thinks I'd be interested in, and he's absolutely right. They, um, I've clicked on most of those. Um, not all of them because already the page that had his recommendations on it is about two pages behind now, you know, on my, on my inbox. But I'll get through it sometime, you know. But the one that concerns me is so-and-so has added you to their circles, right? I don't know what that means. Is that, does that mean that I am now involved in a little sort of group of friends who are going to know everything each other person does? Like Facebook. And I'm scared of not clicking on that to say thank you or not joining the circle in case I offend somebody. And that's my big problem, really. I don't want to offend anybody by not clicking, yes, I'll join this circle. My big fear is not that I'm scared of joining the circle. I'm scared of getting another million messages about people going shopping and having bacon and eggs for their breakfast and stuff. Because, and all from people who I don't know, who are also members of this circle. So I don't need to know what somebody I've never met before is doing for their breakfast or for their lunch or going out that night or something, you know? And I'm scared to click on the circle because I've been, somebody has put added me to their circles. So I'm scared of clicking on it in case I get added to a hundred other people's circle, circles. And then all those people, it's like exponential. I'm gonna end up with hundreds and hundreds of emails coming in telling me what people I don't know are doing because I've clicked on a particular circle. So. Folks, forgive me for this, for not clicking back and stuff. I'm not trying to insult you by not joining the circle that you have added me to, but I simply don't understand how it works, you know? And uh, that's, I don't do Facebook, you see. I don't do any social media. Well, I do, I do. I suppose YouTube is becoming a social media, or ha has always been a social media, but I, I, don't, I don't go any further than that. So um, please forgive me if I don't re- or click back or pay back the invitations and stuff because I don't really understand what's happening. So uh, I'll get my head around it eventually. Um, I was sent, uh, Rob sent me 10 videos on how Google Plus works and stuff and I've only seen the first two because I've just been busy with other stuff. You know, my mother's still in hospital. Um, she's very, still quite unwell, but there's actually talk of her going to a nursing home. So I'll be doing a wee video about that, about attitudes to nursing homes eventually. But there's talks of that happening at the moment, you know, she has, my mother has cheated death about five times in the last ten weeks. It's been absolutely astonishing. Um, so we're still dealing with that issue. Um, so I haven't really had a lot of YouTube time and time for sitting watching videos. And I've got a big queue of videos and I'm kind of working my way backwards at the moment. But I'm, I think I'm going to lose a lot of videos that I haven't watched because they're just going to disappear off my feed. 
But what I'll maybe do is go in and click watch later and see how that works. But anyway, um, that's where I am, folks. I don't really know. I don't really know what's happening with Google Plus, but I'm going to try my best to learn. There you go, folks. That's that's what we have. I'm just going to turn that away, but let you see, let you see them all. So I'm happy with that. That'll do us a brave few dinners, you know. Because just to just rosary myself again now. The children are the children. Like they're in their thirties or thirty. My, my, my son and daughter are way back to England now, and they have been for a few weeks, so they, um, they, we're back to just ourselves and not, having to, not going through the spuds just as fast as we did, you know. So uh, that's that. So uh, there you are, folks, that's our caras. I'm not going to bother measuring them because I, could just, I can't be bothered, you know, to tell you the truth. Um, why do I lift for the newbies, for people who maybe haven't seen me doing this before? Why am I saving up little potatoes like that? Because if I put those into the compost and they get into the beds, they'll grow as potatoes next year. So I want to get them out now before that happens. So, um, where are we? So that's us folks. Um, Thanks for all the messages you did give me on the other, on the other, uh, that last video. I do appreciate what you said. And will normal service will be resumed eventually, but just need time to get my head together, okay? So, uh, all the best now. Bye-bye.